Hello YouTube, it's your boy Vintage Doing Finds back for another exciting junk jewelry slash watch video. So if you like the content, please like, comment, subscribe. I love hearing from you guys. At the thrift store today, I saw this for $14.50. This is a Saint Martiz watch. Very rare watch. So I bought it. Now this is not a sandwich bag. This is a heavy duty bag. So when you see me opening it with a knife, just know that's why I'm doing it this way. A lot of you guys always tease me for using a knife on a sandwich bag. So, let's jump in. Here's the watch. Ooh, and it's missing the um, cap. But it looks in good shape. So I'll put that to the side for now. Hopefully that shows up. Because I don't think I'll be able to get that part. Here's an earring. This looks like... Oh yeah, sterling. A little bit of scrap silver. other earring you see this one's missing yeah a couple of the things so a couple dollars in scrap silver Another watch, one of those bangle ones. Nine two five comes with like a looks like a cubic zirconia. Not a bad little score, little cubic. Probably get 30 bucks for that. Is this anything? Nope. So yeah, I don't think this is real Pandora. No, this is like a Pandora style. Fashion cufflinks. Now the stuff I don't have any desire for, I donate them to my friend's thrift store. He gets a couple bucks. Yeah, it doesn't look like silver. That looks like silver. We won't worry testing the silver unless we get something like a big chain. But my friend, he'll appreciate this. He usually gets a buck or two each. The other cuff link. Anson. 12k gold filled. That got me excited until I saw it was gold filled. Oh wow. 14k. JD Joe something. 
But yeah, that would be a pen into a charm. That's 14K, wow. We're actually doing pretty good with this bag. Costume jewelry. I find, you know, that usually the smaller pieces is where you get the gold. Oh, I was excited for a sec, because that was almost like Pandora style. Where's the clasp on this? Oh, it's magnetic. That's how you know it's nothing. Almost looks like it could be something. No. Even these, they're a set. Donate them. Always baffles me why the thrift store wouldn't at least try to donate them or to sell them. This looks like it could be silver. Yeah, it doesn't look quite right. What's this? Stamp. Nothing. Anson, the other 12K one, that's kind of cool. I get some of these pearls. Yeah, these are all broken. You never know, maybe somebody who does arts and crafts would like these. I don't know. Okay. Gucci. Obviously not real. Nothing. something looks like silver but not probably not even half a gram blessed there's something in there Yeah, fashion. The other one of those earrings. Hmm. Nine two five. Nothing.
tell by the color. It might be silver, but that looks like brass. Take out some of these big items that just were getting away. Plated. Hoping to find that other, that watch link. Like maybe it came off. Because it's worth a lot more if I have the original band for it. I don't think I'm going to be able to find that link anywhere. This. Nothing. that it could be silver has the right tone let's just look through this quickly then we can go back on the watch probably gonna be silver let's Let's see, let's see, let's see. Look through this quickly. Okay, let's go work on that watch. So we're back. This is the silver we had, nice little pile. Now, unfortunately this watch, a lot of corrosion on the back, it does not work. So, um, I will be selling this for a parts watch, and I couldn't find the extra link. But with the um, silver, even as a parts watch, gold pendant, I did okay. Oh, and also, before I forget, in the bag before I ended the video, this was in the corner. Sterling Little Curling Club pin. So, thanks for watching. See you on the next one.